Welcome to the BYU Family History Library. This video provides instructions for using the Ion Tape to PC USB cassette archiver to digitize the content of audio cassettes using the EZ Vinyl Tape Converter software. Before explaining the details of the digitizing process, here are some general instructions. The BYU Family History Library has a very useful collection of electronic equipment for scanning and digitizing books, documents, photographs, photographic slides, 8mm and Super 8mm movie film, VHS cassettes, 8mm video cassettes, audio cassettes, and Betamax tapes. All this equipment is available for use by patrons of the library free of charge during the time the library is open. However, it is best to contact the library through its website and click on the link to the scanning equipment page to check equipment availability. If you have a BYU login, you can then use this page to reserve a time to use the equipment. If you do not have a BYU login, then you can see the times available for using the equipment and contact the Family History Library help desk to make a reservation. Please be aware that some audio recordings are protected by copyright law. You are responsible for determining if any specific audio you transfer is covered by some country's laws. Becoming aware of the copyright restrictions that apply to the audio you are interested in digitizing is an important part of being a responsible family historian. Each machine may have its own way of storing the digitized images or audio files they produce. Make sure you know how and where your files will be stored before you start digitizing and scanning. If you are uncertain about saving your files, you can also ask for help at the help desk. The BYU Family History Library computers will automatically erase any data stored on them when you log off. So it is advisable to use your own flash drive, hard disk drive, or online storage website to store your digitized files. The Help Desk has helpful Get Started instruction sheets for using the software. Please take a moment to review the instructions before starting to use the equipment. The functions of the ION Tape to PC USB cassette archiver are controlled by the EZ Vinyl Tape Converter software, and so you will not need to adjust the equipment's manual controls unless instructed to do so. If you need assistance with your cassette or the operation of the ION Tape to PC USB cassette archiver and the EZ Vinyl Tape Converter software, please ask for help at the help desk. The Ion Tape to PC USB Cassette Archiver has more functions than can be covered in this video. You can find the complete instructions in the Digital Owner's Manual available online. Make sure that the audio cables are connected to the computer. Turn on the Ion Tape to PC USB Cassette Archiver and insert your cassette in the B drive. Log on to the BYU Family History Library portal and click on the icon for the EZ Vinyl Tape Converter Program. Make sure your tape is at the beginning or where you want to start converting the audio recording. Click to open the EZ Vinyl Tape Converter software and then click Next to advance to the Record screen. On the Record screen, select Record and then press the play button on the ION taped PC USB cassette archiver to start converting your tape. Check Split Recording Section into Tracks for the software to automatically split your recording into tracks. Otherwise, leave that unchecked. You can manually split the tracks into new tracks by selecting New Track Between Tracks. The screen will show the progress of the recording and when the recording is finished. Click Next to then stop the cassette and enter the information about the recording, such as artist, album, and track titles, as you prefer, and then select Next. You can choose to continue recording another cassette. 
or open a file location for saving the audio files on your desktop. Save your recording to the desktop and end your session. Verify that you have saved your cassette recording to your flash drive, hard disk drive, or online storage location. Be sure to eject your storage device and take it with you when you leave. Also, remember to take your audio cassette. We thank you for your interest in using the equipment in the BYU Family History Library and hope that you will take advantage of the opportunity provided to preserve your ancestral heritage. Keep learning and thanks for watching.